Hello everyone and welcome back to Crypto Lively, cryptocurrency news and media. And in today's video we're doing a news recap for Holochain, the winner of our community Twitter poll at Crypto Lively. And from the Twitter campaign we want to give a big thank you to Robert M underscore fund, Crypto Jesus. Uh, you were really instrumental into spreading the word for this poll with your retweets and likes, so thank you for your support. We want to give a big thank you to the almost 200 people that voted in that poll and the over 64% of you that voted for Holochain. So it's clear the audience wants to know more about Holochain and wants a news update. Holochain is not a blockchain. Instead, it is a distributed peer-to-peer -peer protocol designed for decentralized applications. In blockchain, each node remains in the same state, maintaining verification of all of the network's transactions. This is what causes the slowness and requirement of small transactions per second and reduces scaling opportunities. Holochain does not work like that. Instead, they're an agent-centric protocol. We'll have to dive deeper into Holochain in future videos as it is some exciting new technology. But for now, let's jump into some of the news topics. So the first topic we will discuss in this video is the current price of Holochain and some ICO statistics, we'll just do a quick review. Then next we will go into Junto, launched by the Junto Foundation. Uh, this is going to be a distributed social media app built on Holochain, and they are not doing a utility token, they're actually doing a Kickstarter uh, to raise funds. And then we will also touch on Holoports, they are still on track for delivery in Q1. And last we will touch on an article posted by Binax News. And this is in regards to Holochain being the most undervalued uh, app protocol for decentralized applications. Without further ado, let's hop into the topics. All right, guys, and starting off here with coinmarketcap.com, we just want to scroll down the list to find Holo. Holo, here we are. H O T. We want to click on that currently ranked number 30. And from here, we can see that it's trading at just about a tenth uh, of a cent, a little bit more than a tenth of a cent, 35 Satoshi. So let's go into some of the ICO statistics here. So this was uh, branded as cloud storage, uh, the first step toward a decentralized hosting ecosystem. And we see here some impressive returns since their ICO. So they sold uh, one hot ERC-20 um, for looks like about one one hundredth of a cent. And now obviously we've done almost a 10 times return in USD, a 40 times return in Ethereum and a 20 times return in Bitcoin. So if you had invested just one Bitcoin, you would have now 20 Bitcoin uh, from the ICO to current price. And it looks like they had their ICO during, you know, the, one of the worst times in the recent market. This was in March, April of 2018. Uh, this is just as the, the prices of cryptocurrency were continuing to crash off of their all-time highs. So as we see, we did not have participation from China, South Korea, or USA. Uh, those are all pretty big uh, cryptocurrency markets. So that might be an indicator as why the price of the ICO went up afterwards, because these entrants could not enter the ICO. They had to enter in secondary markets. Uh, so that's a possibility of why the market cap has gone up. I'm not saying the project isn't great itself. It does have an extremely high circulating supply of tokens, as we see here. Um, that's 133 billion hot circulating supply with a total supply of 177 billion. So quite a lot in circulation. So it doesn't take much of a price movement to increase market cap. All right, hopping on into the next topic here. So decentralized applications are getting ready for Holochain. We have Junto launched by the Junto Foundation, is trying to create a different kind of social media, one without ads, ratings, censorship, or profiteering. All the best for you, if you're getting tired of a certain three-letter acronym. FUD, you fools. <laughs> Junto won't have any utility tokens for the crowd sale, which is interesting. Junto is based on Hollow Hut, a distributed peer-to-peer -peer protocol that's especially designed for decentralized applications. Very interesting that they won't hold a crowd sale or utility token sale. Hmm. Hollow enables hosts to serve as proxies for other users. And it was founded in 2016. Uh, so this is just a crypt Holo's cryptocurrency to perform their services. Uh, these hosts are using Holo's cryptocurrency to perform their services. So they're experiencing no bottlenecks. Junto itself is not issuing a cryptocurrency. So that's just definitely important to reiterate. Uh, so this highlights the fact that projects can build on Holochain without doing the whole ICO uh, 
launch and fundraising method. So instead of doing the token sale, they're actually doing a hundred thousand uh, Kickstarter, which is not too much. You see a lot of the project asking for multiple millions in the ICO market. So Junto here only asking for a hundred thousand. So we'll post the link to this article here. You guys can feel free to read the rest of it there. Next, we go on to Hollow Ports, which is still on track for delivery in Q1. Um, so this is just check out the packaging for the hollow ports, uh, rough version of what our backers will receive, but wanted to give you a quick peek. So here are some of the passionate uh, unboxers in the community. They'll be able to get a little sneak peek of what's to come. I'm sure there'll be some unboxing videos uh, for this product coming out soon. So the third iteration of what you've seen in the image is primarily about the positioning, box fit, format, materials. You may have noticed the colors are off a bit. Uh, so this Final prototype will be more robust, very resistant to shipping damage. Pantone matched with special color printing, great hiding place for playful cats, clutter, and printed on recycled paper, 100% recyclable. So this is the box here. Looks like this might be uh, related to node building. So in milestones of the Holo roadmap, Holo closed alpha testing promised in February, not public, but only available to Indiegogo alpha beta testers. Holo port shipped, Indiegogo in first batch, Holo port store in second batch. Uh, that is it here. So they have a customized uh, module here for the Holo port, Holo port plus, and Holo port nano. So it's very interesting that they're delivering a physical uh, product here. And it looks, you know, pretty some pretty good marketing put into it as well. The stickers look nice. The printing looks nice. It looks sleek in design. Almost looks like an Apple product. Uh, so this might be what the agent uh, would would be on the Holochain network. All right, and onto the uh, last article here, we see Holochain, the most underrated network for dApps. This was an article recently published on Binax News. So dApps are facing various teething problems that are preventing their wild, widespread adoption. Some of them are disruption and scalability that nips them in the bud. Ethereum, for instance, has been criticizing for having negligible transaction volumes in very few users, 90% uh, of its dApps. So Ethereum was the first to have most dApps, but in uh, network prevented its widespread adoption. They're going in over an overhaul and should increase various features to enhance scalability and transactions per speed. However, Holochain has addressed these problems from the onset. Hologen was launched by the Junto Foundation in an attempt to create something that is novel and game-changing. No ads, no profiteering, uh, no ratings or censorship is what makes Hologen interesting. And it's uh, been built from the ground up to cater to decentralized applications. So again, guys, it doesn't seem like a lot of projects uh, use anything outside of Ethereum right now. So Hologen could be another option for those projects if they wanted to uh, take the route of decentralized application. So as always, guys, you want to check out on Twitter. This is at hollow. They seem to be the official account here for hollow, the distributed P2P hosting platform. So any more information, they have a variety of good stuff in their Twitter account here. All right, guys, thank you so much for interacting with us on Twitter and voting for Holochain. I hope you guys like this quick news update video. Stay tuned to our channel for more news updates and reviews on Holochain. Don't forget to subscribe to us here on YouTube, turn on those notifications, and follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Reddit, and Telegram. And don't forget CryptoLiveLeak.org where you can attention mine CLL. Until next time, take care.